hello, this is Lorena, and I'm back with another Dillings video, but I forgot my model, so I have to load it. Which is ridiculous, and it's cursed. I forgot my model, my god. Why do I do this shit? Well, I'm going to be honest with you guys. I just took a break, and I will be honest. I hate pain. So, when my cat just tries to... Dude, I've got human flesh. <laughs> you seriously? I'll go into this in more depth later, even though you guys don't need to hear about it. I have to do 50 assists. I have only done 17. Okay, I better go do more then. But before that, I guess who wants to defend his equations? Bastion, you're going to do a terrible job. And you, want, and you want to know why? Because you're... You're... You're what level again? Level 10. Why do you think this is going to be a defense? You're not going to win this, Bastion. I don't know why you would think you are. Alright, now, now give my model a second to load. I have another item in my inventory. I don't know why, how I keep getting these. Anyway, yeah, a reminder that I'm on Steam. So before I begin the duel, I would just like to say that one of my cats likes to uh, be a bit playful, but her claws they can they can scratch me and she actually is kind of terrifying when she does that when she just reaches out and she just oh, dude no no don't do that my cat is just terrifying the ever living shit out of me every time i go to the bathroom i just like i don't want to get her i don't i don't want to hurt her or anything like that but dear god i hate pain and I'm sure some of you are thinking that makes no sense considering what my obsession is. But my obsession is my obsession, okay? We'll deal with this later and my model still isn't loading for some reason. I think I just made things... Oh my god. This video is automatically cursed. <sighs> Well, anyway, I'm going to- hold on, I'm still, tr I'm still trying to load my model. I guess I'll record a few videos that don't need to exist because of this mistake. We'll see what I come up with, but yeah. I do, in fact, hate pain. Uh, although it may not make much sense because, well, I, I'm obsessed. But, you know, just as a reminder, I said I was obsessed with Yami Merrick once, and I would absolutely be tortured to death. I would be tortured to death if, you know, if we actually interacted. So, I would just like you guys to remember that. Yeah, I don't even know why I was obsessed with him either. I do not know. My brain doesn't tell me this shit when it comes up with obsessions. I just end up obsessed for no reason. Uh, can my model load, please? Because this is, this is very awkward. Uh... Okay, I'm going to, uh... Try to hold the note again. Uh... Okay, and I am done holding that note. I just wanted to do that for some reason. You know, I don't really have any reasons. I don't have any, any explanation, but anyway, my model is back so I can proceed with this duel, even though I didn't really have to do this. <laughs> but because of this mistake, now I'm going to make a few videos that don't need to exist. 
Bastion, you are not going to offend your equations. They suck. I also don't know why you think your equations will help you at level 10, but they wouldn't help you at level 40 either, or level 50, or 60. Uh, do you have a level 70 version, or a level 80 version? I'm not sure. Guys, I am insane. I say I hate pain, but I'm obsessed with a bunch of people. You, you know, I was obsessed with the Merrick, I was obsessed with Quattro, now I'm obsessed with you, Bell. Uh, do you see what the problem here is? Why why does my brain like being obsessed with people that like to inflict pain? There's like one exception to this. One exception that uh, I'm not telling anyone what it is. Because quite frankly, I don't want to remember that time in my life. I would like to move on. And why would I not want to tell anyone about that time in my life where I was obsessed with someone that actually didn't like inflicting pain? Well, I don't know. Maybe I'd still be killed anyway. Maybe. I'm not sure. I'm not sure, but there is a possibility, I guess. Alright, so yeah. Now we know that I have been obsessed with one person that wouldn't exactly have caused sadistic harm to me, but... That person may have decided to kill me anyway. But yes, there's a special mention that this particular person doesn't like inflicting pain. But that doesn't mean I wouldn't be killed. So apparently, the one exception still kills people. <laughs> lovely, lovely. Okay, Bastion, I hate that card you have on the field, so... Send it to the graveyard. Send it there. Good. I don't want to see it again because you lost. Your equations are terrible. <laughs> they didn't save you from me. That's why they're bad. All right. Well, that's it for my duel against Bastion. I know it lasted longer than it should have, but that's because I was, I was cursed. I didn't open. I didn't have my model up. Uh, okay, well, I, I wish I could have- I wish I could say that was, uh... Why? Well, I was busy reflecting on how I hate pain, and my cat kind of just- I feel like I'll end up with scratches all over my legs at one point, because she just scratches me. <laughs> now, now she- now I'm protected by pants right now, but... As things- as things get harder here... I'll just, I'll, I'll wear a skirt and, you know, that's not going to protect me from being scratched. Yes, my shadows are quite powerful, be jealous, or don't, I don't care. The Vagabond is back, well, never mind, hold on, I had to kill it. Uh, I, I don't, actually. And we don't actually know what gender the Vagabond is. However, I'm assuming that's... You're back? Why did you come back? Why well, you came back, you bastard? <laughs> oh, oh. Uh, you're level 10 too? Well, you suck. <laughs> you're terrible. I will show off my, uh, generate... My generation supremacy, which I can only... I do, uh, with, G with DM, and sometimes not even then. <laughs> because legacy support, and also I just get my ass kicked by a lot of people, and do I really have to duel? I can just auto-duel this guy, because he's, st he's, he's stupid. <laughs> Would you like to know why? <laughs> but, well, you see, this may be very familiar to you. If it sounds too good to be true, why the hell are you trusting someone? Are you just going to trust someone like this, Arcana? You're dumb! <laughs> Let's see, huh? Viper, dumb. Leo, uh, hold on a second. This is the wrong argument. Uh, the Leo was dumb, but for a different reason. And if you're wondering who I'm talking about, I'm talking about Declan's father, not Leo the signer. Um... Who else did something stupid that I called him out for? 
I'm not talking about time travel bullshit. Um, I'm talking about, uh... Well, I called out Leo and Viper, so I guess... Maybe, maybe I did mean to say Leo there, I'm not sure. But, but you see... Arcana really thought that he would get what he wanted. Really. Really. Well, you deserved what you got, Ar Arcana. You, you're just stupid. You're dumb. Yeah, and, that's, and he, he, just, he just suffered. And you know what? I don't care. Because most of Merrick's rare hunters are just terrible. I don't like Mimed, number one. Although, String's fate is pretty, uh... His backstory is painful, but I still hate mimes. Alright, I'm actually trying to do- Okay, anyway. You want to know my opinions of the other rare hunters? Umbra and Loomis, uh, I don't believe they even have a backstory, so they're even worse. Um, Arcana, you- Well, I can roast him, but his backstory is depressing and kind of relatable. But he was still dumb, so I still have to roast him for that. Because if, if Merrick came to me and asked me to be a rare hunter, uh... To be honest, maybe I wouldn't- maybe I wouldn't have a choice in the matter. Maybe he would force me. Alright, well, I, I guess I don't have a choice then, but... At least I wouldn't be agreeing to it like an idiot. Okay, well, you know what? I could probably eventually resist the influence of the Millennium Rod <laughs> because Joey overcame the influence of the Millennium Rod. <laughs> I could probably do the same thing because I'm very, very, very stubborn and difficult to influence. And sure, the Millennium Rod would probably work on me, but only for a while. Only for a while because... <laughs> I would find a way to overcome that shit. And again, Joey did it. So it's possible that I would do it as well. Because, well, I'm just saying, don't call me some kind of Mary, don't call me a Mary Sue or some shit. Don't do that, because that would be dumb. I still remember the days of the Mary Sue, and I'm just like, oh god. I feel like people would call me one, but you know what? Wait a minute! What the heck? Did I say we're allowed to do that? Well, I guess it doesn't matter because I don't get it. I'm auto dueling, so I don't get to say anything. Um. Okay, yeah, I'm screwed. Too bad! Maybe I shouldn't have auto dueled this. Anyway, moving on. Uh, what was I saying? Oh, right. The days of the Mary Sue. Yeah, those days haunt me. I, I don't think I fully recovered. I, I would like to say that I'm no longer cringe, but I think that I kind of am in a way. But I'm not the most cringe person out there. I'm just, well, I, I want things, you know? I... I have a- I have things that I desire, you know, like everyone else. It's very- Mai, would you do something? Finally, I'm not sure why you just sat there. But this is why you lose, Mai. This is why you lose! <laughs> oh my god. But, yeah, I'm just like... I've got things that I want in life. And I don't want anyone getting in the way of that. So, I don't want the Mary Sue to get in my way either. Although, I do think that some people would think some of my characters are. But you know what I have to say to that? I don't care. I don't care! I will proceed to... Wait, am I actually going to win this? That would be an interesting plot twist, but I have not dueled Zone in this entire video. Uh, oh my god, well that's so far. Not so far. Wait a minute, why would you do that? Are you not able to do that to any of his monsters? 
What kind of deck is this? Who is someone's cat girl magician? What kind of use does that card have? Well, maybe I should read. <laughs> maybe I should, but you know what? I'm too busy not caring. All right, well, we're gonna play that destroy the spell. Okay, well, I am already dueling, so that isn't what happened. But it looks like I'm about to win, which is actually a plot twist. I didn't expect that. I expected to lose, to be honest. Why would you destroy yourself? <laughs> what kind of protection did that spell have? That was the only card on my opponent's side of the field. <sighs> oh my god. Well, at least I won. That was a surprise. I didn't actually expect that to happen. <sighs> Alright. Well, I have to go to 5D's world now. Mai is slowly approaching level 43, which is good. Though, it'll be a while before she's maxed out. And when she's maxed out, I'm considering leveling up someone else in DM world, but I don't know who yet. Actually, she'll just, she'll deal these people real quick. Yeah, this tool has no chance. I hope I don't break. I said, I hope I don't brick, and this is bricking. Hmm. Well, at least my monsters can't be stolen because I don't have any. Uh, oh my god. And now I have a monster that can be stolen. But let's hope that doesn't happen because if it does, if it does, well, I'm cheating. <laughs> Konami, you have this skill in the game that allows that. <sighs> Don't ban me. This skill allows me to. Also, even though I do have this skill, that hasn't stopped me from losing. <laughs> I have lost with this skill. Though, even if you cheat, you can still lose. So, there is that. I'm sure Pegasus knows this quite, quite well. <laughs> and Bandit Keith as well. Yeah, I'm just calling you out, Bandit Keith. You probably cheese more, you probably cheat more than Pegasus. <laughs> in fact, I would say that Bandit Keith's loss in that flashback, his loss there was Karma. <laughs> Karma, Bandit Keith, you cheat more than Pegasus. How do you feel? Well, guess what? I don't give a shit. <laughs> uh, my dad was talking about the last episode he remembers from DM, and he recalls that duel where Yugi was doing Bandit Keith. <laughs> and I'm just like, um, I know which duel you're talking about, but also, Yugi, you maybe don't hold, don't give a random stranger your magical artifact your magical artifact made in egypt i don't think anyone would be asking for it unless they had an, an ulterior motive i'm not sure why you decided it was a good idea to do that but you did and i cannot uh, neutral I have to be neutral here yugi that was a stupid decision you shouldn't have done that i'm not sure why you did well, to be honest, I just can't remember why he did that. It was something about fortune telling, I think. But I still don't remember exactly what the full details were. I'm just like, you really shouldn't just trust a stranger with a magical artifact. Uh, a stranger could just, you know, steal it. 
But this is exactly what happened. Yeah. And that actually... Bandit Keith was being mind controlled for that. But Bandit Keith has stolen things. <laughs> like, on screen. So it's not like it was out of character for him to just steal something. It was just out of character for him to steal that particular thing. <laughs> Unless, of course, he wanted money, then maybe he'd steal it. But I don't know. It, he would have to ri Oh, what level is he? Let me look. Yes, I do have to check. Level 10? Okay, you say, well, you're going to lose, but not right now. Not right now, please don't. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, I'm gonna do a turbo duel. Wait a minute, hold on. Maybe I shouldn't do that. No. No, no turbo dueling for me. It would be a waste. <laughs> I have the power to change a lot of things, though. <laughs> and I'm trying to change my future. Although, you don't believe in free will, do you? Well, I'm going to expose you for being full of shit. Because you obviously do believe in free will or you wouldn't be doing this shit. Why would you time travel if you don't believe in free will? Why are you calling free will an illusion if you're going back to the past to change the future? If you really believe that free will doesn't exist, you wouldn't believe that you can change the future. So because you did go back in time to change the future, there is some credibility that you did believe it was possible. <laughs> oh my god, so you just lost an argument against the protagonists. I'm not sure which ones, but... Which one said that he believed in hope in... I don't remember which character said this. Was it you say? I don't know. But he would say that. I mean, I think. I don't remember that cutscene. It was like a day or two ago. Oh my god. Well, I am doing zone. Apparently, I am being told I have the advantage, even though my opponent has 132,000 life points, which is clearly the advantage. But, we know what I'm about to do, so obviously he's getting his ass kicked. I've only lost once. Actually, that was a draw, and it was because I was dumb. <laughs> I was dumb, I did something stupid to get a draw. But that doesn't matter because that's in the past, right, Zone? You you committed a crime by going back in the past. You time traveled, which is a sin. But do I really believe that? I don't know. I kind of do, but I also I, I it's it's mostly a joke, but I'm also a bit serious because of the consequences of time travel. <laughs> But we all know that I'm joking mostly, D don't we? I mean, I wouldn't roast anyone for going back in time to save the future from being destroyed by paradox, would I? No! But that was still a sin! I said that I had to be neutral, so... Well, Yamayugi didn't sin because he didn't go back to the past, but then again... Uh, paradox didn't go back in the past in this game. He just used gates or something. I don't know. Actually, did he do that? No, no, that was Yusei and Jaden that used gates. Paradox was like, what? How did you get here? <gasps> okay, yeah. Alright, sure. Paradox, you're an idiot. <gasps> oh my god. But, yeah, time travel is just not a good idea. And it should stay in the realm of fiction. Although that is where time travel is. In fiction. 
Um, unless you believe those people that say they went to the past or the future or whatever. I can't speak on that. I honestly just hope I never have any experiences like that. <laughs> you know, I experience a lot of weird shit, but no, don't- I don't need to experience any of that shit. I would be scared out of my mind. You know, like I fear pain. I fear- wait a minute, hold on a second. I am very afraid of pain. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, we all think that I have credibility with that. Well, okay, sure. Although, to be honest, if you're skeptical, there is a good reason to be skeptical, but... Let's leave skepticism out of the comment section, because I don't think YouTube wants it on the platform. Yeah, I'm putting- I'm putting words into YouTube's mouth or whatever. YouTube are questionable! Okay, you gained life points, but that didn't matter, you just lost. You lost! So, yeah. He's stating the obvious, he's like, I don't understand how you won. Well, too bad, it's because I have bonds. Bonds, remember? I will weaponize my bonds to destroy you for the sins you have committed. <laughs> you have done many things. You have done many things, Zone. You are going to get your ass kicked for this over and over and over. And the only thing that will save you is Konami. Until you're added to the gate, then you'll join Paradox in Hell. <laughs> oh my god. Oh god. Anyway, guys, that's going to wrap things up for this video. In the next video, I'm going to destroy Zone again, because that has to happen. This is a raid event, and I love raid events for some reason. So I'll see everyone in the next video.